Hi Sagittarius, this is Petra at Indigo Tarot Dot Club, and I'm here to do a general psychic tarot reading for you for the week of Monday, May 22nd through Sunday, May 28th. I've already shuffled and cut the cards from various decks, so let's get started. For work, Sagittarius, I have the Ace of Cups. For home, I have Strength. For love, I have the Ace of Rods. For money, I have Death. For unexpected, I have the Chariot. So for Ace of Cups, Sagittarius, at work, it feels like something has made you very happy at work and it feels like you've recently gotten a big raise. And you have some new responsibilities, but they're super easy for you to do, for you to handle. You're very capable of these responsibilities. So to you, it feels like child's play and you're super excited because of the extra amount of money that you're getting for doing this work that for you is super, super simple. For some of you, a few of you, you're going to get to go to the beach and be there overnight, possibly on a weekend and have a lot of fun with your friends. So that's good. That's nice. Okay. For home, I have the strength card and it feels like you're just going to be, because of your extra money, your spouse is going to be super happy because you've bought this person a gift recently, or you're going to buy this person a gift with the extra money that you're making at work. And that's going to make them extra frisky. And so both of you are going to have a lot more fun this week than you have in a long time. For love, I have the Ace of Rods. This is pulling back to the strength card. You're going to have a lot of fun with your spouse in the bedroom. For money, I have death. And it feels like a major transformation is coming. It feels like it's tied again to this extra money that you're getting from this big promotion. And it looks like two or three people are leaving that job. And that is how this extra money came to be to uh, put towards your salary. And even though it's a lot of work that these people did, they're very happy that they're moving on to greener pastures. And you're very happy because the work that they're doing, again, you're able to do it. You're able to handle this this um, effortlessly. So this is just a big transformation in things at your house because of things going on at your job and the things at your house, you're going to be able to buy more things for your children. If you have children. And like I said, for your spouse and for yourself, you're going to have more money to spend and more money to spend on travel too, not just on things at your house. For unexpected, I have the chariot and I'm being drawn to the number seven in the card. It feels like you're um, striving to be more spiritual. Some of you are going to be striving to be more spiritual this week. For some of you, it's because you're very grateful because of this extra money that's come into your household recently. Okay, so let's look at the days for you. So for Monday, for the Ten of Cups, it feels like you and your spouse are going to be very happy about something that you've completed. It feels like it has something to do with furnishing your house it feels like you bought some plants and furniture for the interior of your house and this week you all are setting it up or you've just completed um, setting it up where you want to set it up and for some of you you're using feng shui to do this you had someone come in to consult with to um, figure out where to place your furniture and plants For others of you, you just did it the way you wanted to do it, the way you thought it would look aesthetically pleasing. And so you're very happy because you're finishing that this week or you've just finished doing it this week. For Tuesday, I have the four of staffs and it feels like some of you are being invited to an engagement party. Some of you are going to go alone. Some of you haven't danced in a while. It feels like you're going to actually dance at this party because you're so happy for this person. You're very close to this person that's engaged. And for Wednesday, I have the King of Wands. It feels like there's going to be a fire sign interacting with you on this day. And it feels like this person is going to be testing you, questioning you. It feels like he doesn't maybe trust you or something. Fire signs are Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Or it may just be someone that's, I'm feeling more a male than a female. But someone that's very 
energetic, passionate, nurturing, warm person usually. But it just feels like this person is going to be questioning you on Wednesday. And then on Thursday, I have the Six of Pentacles. It feels like you and your family or you and your spouse, if you don't have any children, are going to be spending some time together like on a date. And you're going to have fun. And even though it's going to cost money to do this, you don't mind. You're very happy about spending time with your loved one on this day. Okay, for Friday, I have the Seven of Coins. This feels like it's tied to your work. It feels like there's going to be a little bit of uncertainty on your part as far as handling all the responsibilities that you have to deal with this week. But it feels like you're going to have an assistant, a brand new assistant come in and you're not sure how capable this person is because you just met them. But it looks like they're going to do a really good job of helping you get all your ducks in a row at work. For Saturday, I have the Hierophant, and it feels like somebody's going to invite you to some event. Uh, it could be, for some of you, it feels like it's a bingo, bingo, I don't know what you call it, session. <laughs> but for others of you, it's uh, it's a luncheon. And then for others of you, it's some other type of event. It may involve you having to wear, like, dress clothes. It may be like a some kind of place where you dance like a ballroom or something. So it feels like you're going to do that on Saturday or be invited to something like that on Saturday. And then for Sunday, I have the 10 of staffs, Sagittarius. It looks like you're going through some grueling back breaking work this week. It feels like it has to do with something outside. It feels like it could be at someone else's house, not yours that you're doing some work. Some of you are doing some work, uh, uh, pouring cement to turn into concrete. Others of you, it feels like you're putting some stakes up to erect a fence of some sort. But it, it just looks like some of you are going to go through some backbreaking work. It's not actually going to break your back. It's just going to be tiring for you. And you're going to need some extra TLC at home. And I see some of you actually telling your spouse, you want them to rub your feet when you come home because you're going to be super tired. You are going to get some money from this person to show their appreciation. They're going to give you some money or they're going to give you some kind of gift card to some restaurant or something. Okay, Sagittarius, I hope you enjoyed that reading. I look forward to seeing you next week. I appreciate you watching my videos. Let me know if you like this format in the comments below. And thanks for watching. This is Petra at IndigoTarot.club.